Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Sunday, the 28th of March. <laughs> and uh, I wanted to hop on here and show you one of my finished objects that I couldn't show you until now. Um, because the pattern has been released by the designer. So the designer is Elisa from uh, Anaya's Toy Box. She contacted me a few weeks ago asking me if I would test Amigurumi for her. And I was like, yes, because <laughs> I love her patterns and I love Amigurumi. So this is what it is. It's called Aviator Bird. <laughs> I think it's a like a seagull. Ta -da! <laughs> it's a very quite tall. <laughs> Mine is. I use worsted weight um, scraps and an F hook and fiber fill and I do have safety eyes up here. So yeah, it's a super cute bird. Down here is its little feet. And uh, her pattern shows this in blue, I believe. But I went with pink because I love pink. <laughs> and there's the wings and there's a the tail. And then the little face has a beak and some goggles. An aviator hat with the headphone thingies on there. Super cute. I almost put a mouth on it and I was like, wait a minute, the beak is the mouth. <laughs> so it would have been weird if I put a mouth and then had a beak. <laughs> But luckily I didn't do that. <laughs> but yeah, I think it's adorable. So you could obviously change the yarn size and hook size to make it smaller or larger if you wanted to. And um, she actually basically said that when she asked me to test it. She said that I could use any yarn hook combo I wanted. So I used my go-to, <laughs> which is worsted weight and an elf hook. I think it's adorable. Um, I've been calling it she because it's wearing pink, but you know, boys can wear pink too, but I just call it she. <laughs> so she's so cute. There is a little bit of sewing involved with these goggles and the little hat and everything. There's pieces you have to sew together, but it's very simple. And um, you just sew it on there. I did sew it a little too tight so you can see where it divots in. But it's okay. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's going to be Jessie's bird anyways. It's got these little suspenders that you put on after the fact. Super cute. Very quick pattern, and I think it's pretty easy. Um, I wouldn't say this is a beginner, beginner amigurumi pattern, but it's like a advanced beginner. Only because some of these things up here. <clears throat> are a little bit more difficult for people who haven't made a lot of amigurumi before but if you've made amigurumi before this will be easy it does have a, a quite a bit of sewing but um it still comes together super cute and mine can stand up if it's leaning on something and uh, it could also be put in a seated position kind of <laughs> if you wanted to like lean it up in a bookshelf but uh this one's meant to be a toy so jesse will play with this and it'll look all raggedy <laughs> here soon but it's an adorable pattern so if you want to check it out i will link below the ravelry page for it and uh definitely check it out because it's an adorable little pattern i love the colors it's just pretty i love it but yeah so this is from elisa at anaya's toy box i will link her the pattern below and her youtube channel below she has a really nice youtube channel she shares all kinds of really cute things <laughs> definitely check her out she makes really nice amigurumis always i actually got one that she gifted me so um it's in my living room all the amigurumis i get gifted to me stay in my living room on a shelf even if they're holiday specific i uh, keep them out all the time because i like looking at them <laughs> but yeah so check out the pattern and Definitely, even if you don't uh, get the pattern and you have a Ravelry, you could still uh, favorite it so that it will uh, pop up more. Because on Ravelry, it's kind of like most places, the more interaction a pattern has, the more it pops up in searches. And, you know, people can search by most favorited or it'll pop up. If it gets really faint, popular, it'll pop up on the Ravelry, um, the Ravelry pattern search page as like the hot patterns at the time. So uh, it's always good to favorite shops on Ravelry and items because it helps uh boost the creator which is always good <laughs> anyways i'm gonna hop off here and i'm gonna give this bird finally to jesse because it's been hiding i've had it hidden <laughs> so that he wouldn't get it all dirty and uh it's real gloomy so the lighting's horrible today but i mean it's been really stormy i'm sorry <laughs> and my hair's going like crazy but that's okay it doesn't matter <laughs> anyways i'm gonna get this video out so you guys can check out this pattern because it just released today i'm pretty sure because uh, i just got the email about it so anyways yeah check it out <laughs> bye guys <laughs> 